I know some of you don't know, some of y'all didn't, that didn't know Cool Radio had a brother, Cool Rock. Y'all got to excuse my voice. And this is Radio Baby Brother, Cool Rock, and I just want to introduce the world. This is Cool Rock, yeah. Cool Rock. I just wanted to say, I thank God that he hired me. I'm saying that God hired me to take care of radio. And it may not have been easy always, but radio, radio was a blessing. He was a blessing to us. He was a blessing to the community. And I thank God for the assignment. And now that the assignment is complete, I'm like, Lord, what else you want me to do? And I just thank the community of Anderson. I thank T.O. Hanna. And I thank everybody far and near in his T.O. Hanna family. You guys rock. Thank y'all so much for all that y'all do. I know the world says that he's special needs, but the Lord spoke to me and said he needed to be special. So that's what I said. He needed to be special to bring all of you guys here. And we are so grateful for the love of the Anderson community, far and near, even out of state, in state, and across the country. We are very grateful for the love that you guys have for radio. And I thank God of how much of an impact that he have had upon our lives and the lives of this community. Radio taught us how to love. He taught us respect. Even when people may have mistreated him, Radio still said, I love you. Even in his last days, and he just said with his eyes closed, Jackie, I love you. I said, Radio, I love you too. Now, all times he ain't love me. <laughs> he, it was one, um, you know, you can't sleep on radio. You can't sleep on and. He was walking real soft, and I had my eyes closed on the couch one night. And I closed my eyes, and I was looking out my peripheral. He was trying to tiptoe, walk past me, and he was going to the room loaded with food and drinks and stuff. <laughs> and I said, radio, bring all of it back. He looked at me and said, you ain't nothing but the devil. <laughs> I said, radio, I'm trying to help you. And I said, he said, well, good night. I, said, I didn't say no. So I went and answered him, and he said, Jackie, you heard me? I said, good night. I said, I thought you said I was the devil. He said, you know I love you. <laughs> and I'm going to really miss him. It's just the impact that he has on my life and my children. He really has blessed so many people, and I'm so grateful for everybody. I don't take it for granted. And like I said, you know, who knew that Radio Lives was going to touch so many people? A man from the east side of town. Somebody that grew up on east side. And a lot of times you always think that it was a bad uh, town, but God knew his purpose in life. He knew what he had to do. And so I'm still so grateful to, that God chose me to be his caretaker. I'm grateful for all of you that came out to support him. Even when everybody said, well, I'm not going to be able to make it. It's all right. I knew that y'all loved him. And I just want to say thank you. And the radio had three names. My grandmother called him James Robert. Eastside called him Cap Buster. <laughs> and uh, Anderson County and T.L. Hannah called him radio. And we just want to say thank you from our hearts to you guys. And as I take my seat, I just want to leave one thing with you, that last stand. Thank you all. <laughs>